first off, I want to give all praises and glory to the Most High Yahweh in the name of His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai, in the name of the Holy Spirit. In Hebrew, it's called the law Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai Bahashim Rahach Kodash. Double honors into the elders and apostles of GMS who taught me this truth. Salutations to all the brothers out there that's teaching this word and truth and sincerity and peace, blessings and healings onto the elect because that's why we do these videos. And uh, today I want to talk about this man. It says this video was popular YouTube limiting viewers for small channels. You know, when um, this trucker convoy was going on, some uh, people was um, some small YouTubers were uh, live streaming it, and then this popped up. It says video unavailable. This video is popular due to limited creator history. We're limiting the number of viewers. Okay. Subscribe to this channel to help this creator reach a broader audience. Okay, that's why they took the dislikes away. You know what I'm saying? So they can censor content. You know what I'm saying? Point blank period. You know, so. You know, we at that uh, time of um, famine of the word, man. You know, we're at that time of famine of the word. That's what a lot of brothers is moving um, platforms, going to Odyssey, going to BitChute. You know what I'm saying? Because we basically at that time. So let's read a little bit of this. It says, A strange new message is appearing on live streams and videos of creators who have a low subscriber count or limited creator history. And YouTube is currently limiting the amount of viewers the video was allowed to receive, promoting new visitors to subscribe to the channel. This is family of the world, man, because, you know, they don't want nobody to see um, an opposing viewpoint. And they definitely don't want nobody to wake up to the truth. Okay. Point blank period. It says they want people to go along with their narrative they're doing right now. You know, but there's a lot of people outside their narrative. That's why uh, uh, the Canadian president said he had, you know, he's sick when this the biggest protest in human history is going, over, going on over there in Canada. You know what I'm saying? Because they don't want to deal with it. You know, they just want to, they just want to roll out their new world order. You know, uh, 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 without any um, backlash, but it's going to come to a point where, you know, basically they're just going to come down with great wrath and do it by force. Okay, that's what the scriptures say. So they're going to, you know, do their thing, but eventually they're going to get tired of the people and just bring it down by force, force, force. Okay, and we know that, but censoring and all this stuff has to go on. It says... YouTube may be trying to encourage channel engagement with this strange new message, but sadly, it reeks of censorship. Reeks of censorship, and it does, man. You know, because like I said, you got the biggest, you know, um, protests, these truckers in uh, Canada. They deep, deep, you know, and basically they censor in, uh, who can watch it. We're limited the number of viewers. Limiting the number of viewers, so... Super censorship. It says, if a video posted by a channel with a low sub count is doing rel relatively well, YouTube will block access to the content with the following video unavailable message. This message right here. Crazy. You know. So, family of the word is basically here and near. Okay. A lot of smaller YouTubers have reported that the message has popped up for them when they get a lot of viewers during their live streams and a lot of brothers um, live stream on the weekends on Friday you know when they go preach on the streets so ain't no telling if somebody clicks on that video and they're gonna see this message you know family of the word man you know um, yeah, how about some Shah said you know this grace period wouldn't last forever anyway so you got a, you got a lot of time to repent you know what I'm saying? It's better to repent now than later. You know, and basically when you see, um, you know, the world right now, it's, it's going to shit. So that's why they're coming down with all the censorship. You know what I'm saying? It says, a lot of smaller YouTubers have reported that this message has popped up for them when they get a lot of viewers doing their live streams, according to the reports. YouTube have implemented a viewer threshold to certain channels. The only way to increase or remove the threshold is to get more subscribers. 
YouTube censoring trucker convoy. YouTube have not yet made any comments regarding this new message, but it appears to be mainly affecting new channels that are live streaming the Freedom Convoy happening in Canada, Australia, Italy, and many other countries. Okay. Because, you know, um, President Trudeau in Canada, he said that this trucker convoy was a, a fringe movement. And then, um, you know, they it's, it's, it's like, um, that's why if the world right now, these elites, they don't, these these news channels, MSNBC, CNN, Fox, they don't cover the protests that's going on around the world. They don't cover it. Okay, they act like it's never it never happened, but social media is where the people actually see these things. You know what I'm saying? So they're going to crack down on those things. They're going to crack down on social media. Okay? Because they don't want you to see these things. You know, that's why, you know, the saying is that the tele... The uh, revolution is going to be televised. The revolution is not going to be televised. They control all this stuff. So, it just is what it is. It says there has been minimal media coverage of a trucker of the trucker convoys, and people are flocking to YouTube to search for live footage of the event. Trucker Convoy Canada 2022 Live is one of the most searched terms on YouTube at the moment. However, all independent Independent live streams and clips have been completely removed from the search results. Okay, they don't want nobody to see another. They don't want no. They don't want nobody to see the people rising. Okay, because it's gonna. They think it's gonna trigger people to rise up in other places. Okay, so they wanna they wanna crawl this while they can. Okay, you know it's eventually gonna come to insurrections. You know what I'm saying people rising up against their governments but we're not there yet you know but we can be there at any moment it says however all independent live streams and clips have been completely removed from the search results the best way to find an independent live stream of the convoy and the protests is by searching for links on other social media sites however most li most live streams yield the aforementioned video unavailable message they don't want nobody to see anything a representative for Odyssey, a blockchain video sharing site, and YouTube competitors slammed the company for censoring the convoy. You know, Odyssey, bitch, you, you know, YouTube is basically working out all the kinks, all the censorship, you know, but then it's eventually going to go to these sites also, point blank, period, because, you know, wherever the people are, they're going to go censor it, you know, and basically Odyssey and bitch, they're, they're controlled by these people. This is controlled opposition. You know what I'm saying? So I don't want to read that part. But, you know, let's get straight to the scriptures. You know, this is Amos 8 and 11. And, you know, basically, I woke up through the internet. You know what I'm saying? So it's it's going to be harder for somebody to wake up now through the internet with all the censorship going on. So it's, it's a miracle if you wake up now. You know, basically 11th hour. This is Amos 8 and 11. Behold, the days come, say, if you have us in Meshach, that I will send a famine in the land. Not a family of bread nor a thirst for water, but of hearing the words of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh So how do, um, you know, people hear the words of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh The internet. The internet, man. Basically the internet. You know, let's get a couple of scriptures on the internet. You know, I got a couple right here. This is, um, let's go to Matthews. Um, Matthews 24. And uh, 14. It says, um, And this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in all the world for a witness unto all nations, and then shall the end come. So how would this work through the internet, man? You know, because the internet goes to all nations. You know, and that's why you got Filipinos waking up. You got um, people overseas waking up all over the world saying that they're Israelites. You know, the real church is waking up. Let's go to uh, Psalms, 19, Psalms 19 because um, it explains the internet lines. This is uh, Psalms 19 and 1. It says, The heavens declare the glory of God, and the firmament show of his handiwork. Day unto day utter his speech, and night unto night show of knowledge. There is no speech nor language where their voice is not heard. Their line 
is gone through all the earth and the words to the end of the world. And them have you set a tabernacle with the sun. So their line is gone through all the earth and their words to the end of the world. You know, let's look up um, internet cables in the ocean. You know, let's look at this. Images. This. See all this? The words have gone to the ends of the world. So the internet is everywhere. You know, but like I said, that grace period is not going to last forever. So Yahweh Shemeshah doesn't need the internet forever. He only needed the internet to wake up his elect. Now once all the elect wake up, the internet's probably, Yahweh, they're probably going to cut off the internet. Yahweh Shemeshah will let them cut it off. You know, because that's all it was needed for. You know, point blank period. So going back, and it says, And they shall wander from sea to sea, and from the north and even to the east. They shall run to and fro to seek the word of Yahweh and Shai, and shall not find it. So it's eventually going to come to them cutting off. Well, not cut, just basically censoring everything where you won't be able to do anything. Okay, to find anything that's not... um going along with their narrative so that's coming man so it's better to repent now than later you know what i'm saying point blank period and i wanted to get this this is um second corinthians 2 and 11 it says lest satan should get an advantage of us for we are not ignorant of his devices so you know when they took the dislikes away you know we're not ignorant of what they're trying to do they're trying to censor basically um people rising up and all the you know opposing views okay because like i said they're trying to get to the new world order cleanly but that's not going to happen they're going to come down with great wrath as it says in the scriptures because they're, they're going to get tired of it you know what i'm saying but um i want to get this this is uh second thessalonians 2 and 3 this is why they're censoring everything it says let no man deceive you by any means for that day shall not come except they're coming to falling away first and that man is sin be revealed, the son of perdition. So, the man of sin and the son of perdition is being revealed in this time. It says, Who opposeth and exalteth himself above all that is called God or that is worship, so that he as God sinneth in the temple of God, showing himself that he is God. So, that's why they're doing this new world order because they want to be the gods of the earth. Okay. It says, remember ye not that when I was with you, I told you these things. And now you know what we hold if that he might be revealed in his time. So it was, all, it was always a time and a place for these people to get revealed. And we're in that time today. It says, for the mystery of iniquity doeth already work. Only he who will let it flit until he be taken out of the way. And then shall the wicked be revealed whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth and shall destroy with the brightness of his coming. So the wicked is being revealed in this time, man. You got Epstein Island. You got all these people. We know they do sacrifices, blood rituals, bathing blood. You know what I'm saying? They do all this wicked thing. They do all these wicked things, and people are calling them out on it. And it says, "Whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of His mouth." So Yahweh Shemeshah is using men, basically His men, His prophets. Okay, who He sent on the earth to expose these people. Okay, this is Hosea chapter 12, verse 10. I have also spoken by the prophets, and I have multiplied visions and used solitudes by the ministry of the prophets. So you have a is using his prophets to expose these people on a high level. This is Ezekiel 3 and 17. Son of man, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. Therefore hear the word at my mouth and give them warning from me. Okay, so when it says... um. Whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth. He's talking about who he set up on the earth to expose these people for doing all these wicked things. Okay. And then that truth spreads around. And now you see how the truth is being declared and wickedness is being overcome. You know. Um, this is uh, 2nd Ezra 6 verse 28. As for faith it shall flourish. Corruption shall be overcome. So corruption is being overcome right now. That's why. It's like a tit for tat right now with these elites. And it says, And the truth which has been so long without fruit shall be declared. Okay, and that's why it also says that what there shall be a falling away first, because 
you know these people were um these people have been able to do a lot of things without repercussion but we're at the end of time we're at the end days and you have a has sent his prophets in the last days and now these people are getting exposed by the prophets and now they're even getting exposed by their own people you know what i'm saying so they they don't want to hear that you know what i'm saying so they control the information so they're trying to um you know block that information censor that information it says even him who's coming